You can't be Pablo if your work ain't selling. What the f is this chick? Shady gang, what's good? Welcome back to another show with August with the Shade. Listen, go ahead and grab your cups, because you already know I'm about to spill the tea, and y'all know I keep the shade, okay? Now, today's video is going to be about Carisha, Nicki Minaj, as well as Saucy Santana. Let's go ahead and get into the tea. Now, the first thing I want to talk about is uh, Carisha and Nicki Minaj. The reason why I want to get into Carisha and Nicki Minaj is definitely because, you know, everybody has this whole agenda of thinking that Nicki Minaj is some type of mean girl. You know, they always try to uh, put this stigma on Nicki Minaj or the stereotype because they want her to be a certain type of way because of the things that people have said in the industry. But I want to let you guys know that it's not true, okay? Nicki Minaj is a very much so a sweetheart. Everybody has their own little, you know what I'm saying, their little things that they do. But you have to remember, Nicki has been through a lot in this industry. So however she moves, however she tweets, however she does anything, she's a grown woman who has had life experiences in this industry and she's moving how she wants to, okay? Get it, got it good, okay? Now, let's go ahead and get into the tweets. Now, I won't be reading the tweets. Y'all can see this right here on the screen. But I will be getting into what Nicki was trying to say. Now, if you guys don't know, last year or the year before last, Nicki Minaj and uh, Carisha um, and JT all made up. They all have each other's phone number. So, whatever y'all are feeling by reading these couple of tweets by these two girls, it has nothing to do with y'all. They have been on the phone with each other. Y'all gonna be mad when y'all hear a song come out. Y'all gonna be mad when y'all see her on Queen Radio or Carisha, please. It's wrong for you guys to make things a problem when it's not. You guys always say that Nicki Minaj is not a part of female rap um, unity and how she just, like, don't really show, the, you know, the girls love and the new girls and all that. But this is kind of like her showing love. Like, Nicki don't have to acknowledge you girls, okay? Nicki's on a whole nother level than them. So I feel like when Nicki does play with these girls, by her just saying, oh, I'm about to hit up Puff, Puff is her old manager. Puff and or Nicki Minaj and Puff Daddy are friends. So why would y'all think that this like, smoke like that? It ain't no smoke. This could be promo. Like, I really want y'all to stop with the antics, okay? Y'all got the Lotto Clayco girl. Girl, coming out here talking about busting out the rapper when her career been on the flow since she uh since she came in Nicki Minaj and then you got this big back mm, oh let me not say that y'all because I forgot this is a video okay but uh we got this you know this dude with a beard okay this dude with a beard with a reversed BBL okay let's just talk about it because I've never seen a linebacker with a BBL that still looks like a linebacker I'm just saying so let's just get into Saucy Santana now Saucy wanted to go around and add Lotto to this whole little thing by, by quoting her lyrics when we all know that the line that he quoted is the line that she was trying to throw shade at Nicki Minaj now I done told y'all before and I'm, all, I'm not gonna tell y'all again Saucy Santana is an op he was an op then and he's an op now okay and I tried to tell y'all about Bigfoot but nobody wanted to believe me he's worse than Megan he's worse than all of these girls because he's jealous of these girls career not only is he jealous because he does not have a snatch okay but he's also jealous because he doesn't look feminine he doesn't look good let's just talk about it like you look like a linebacker for the Atlanta Hawks like I'm just I just want you to know that like nothing about you is appealing nothing about you is giving what you think is giving like I'm just saying stop trying to come for Nicki Minaj for you really get your, your like get your feelings hurt you ain't made it on nobody's charts you are really a nobody why do you keep on talking like you already ruined the city girls like the girls don't even like you like let's just keep it you lied about being a makeup artist so that you can get on her live. Like, do you want me to spill your tea, Saucy Santana? Because I really got it. I, I, I do. But I'm just going to tell you this. Stay out of women's business. You don't make good women's songs and you don't make songs well, okay? Your raps are very ABC, so I'm going to need you to do your way about this one. You know what I'm talking about? Because we ain't giving you. We, I'm not going to give you too much. I'm not going to give you too much because your body already messed up. Anyway. Carisha and Nicki Minaj are cool, okay? So y'all let it go. Stop trying to make Nicki Minaj something that she's not before. <laughs> August had to spin the block. Like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Make sure that y'all leave y'all comments down below. I want to know what y'all think about this whole, you know, Young Miami and Nicki Minaj situation. And what do you think about the big back, saucy Santana jumping in women's business again, child? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Make sure y'all leave y'all comments below and turn your notification bells on. I'm out. We all got something in common. We all retarded. <laughs>